so welcome back to in my channel so today i'm going to teach you about the transistors so transistors are also one of the uh, very important components which is available inside the mobile phone pcb board and if you are also trying to know more about the transistors then this is the right video for you so after watching this video you will be able to understand about the voltage regulator uh, transistor and bipolar transistor and you will understand about the voltage switch transistor and you will know about the 3 legs mosfet and you will understand about the 6 legs uh, mosfet okay so uh, mosfet means uh, the metal oxide semiconductor fit so today you will know more about the transistor in this video so if you want to know more about all these types of the uh, transistors then you have to watch this video until the last and you will be also able to uh, know about those types of the transistor hello everyone so welcome back to my youtube channel once again so without any date let's begin our tutorial so guys what is transistor transistors are also known as semiconductor device transistor also prepared by making the combination of p and junction same like in the diode Transistor contains three pins and they have their own separate works. Those three pins have their own name known as a base, collector and emitter. Okay. Transistors have many functions such as it helps us to amplify signal, regulate voltage, voltage switching and it have many works. Transistors look like same like two pack of diode. In that condition it will give little bit problem to recognize it but you can easily recognize it using the multimeter and if you don't know how to use the multimeter I have already uploaded a video in my YouTube channel so you can check that video also I'll give you the video link in the uh, video description you can check that one problems may appear in transistor TV is open and shut but you can replace it easily okay so if you get any types of problems in transistor then you can easily replace that one okay so this kind of problems may occur due to the leakage open and shut okay guys so now we are going to discuss the types of the transistor okay so uh, the first one is the bipolar transistor so it have also two types of the uh, bipolar transistor the first one is the voltage regulator transistor and the second one is the voltage switching transistor okay and another types of the transistors is metal oxide mosfet so it have also three types of the metal oxide mosfet so those are three legs mosfet six legs uh, mosfet eight legs mosfet okay so in the last it uh, uh, you you have to know uh, about the pack of transistor also so these all are the types of transistor so now we are discussing uh, from the voltage regulator transistor so what is voltage regulator transistor so now we can see here this is the images of the voltage regulator transistor so uh, especially if you have three three pins okay so now we can see in this side there is three pins right so if you uh, get this type of the transistor in your mobile phone PCB board, then you have to remember this is the voltage regulator transistor. Okay, guys, this is one of the amazing transistor available in mobile phone. Especially, it is also known as a bipolar transistor, which help us to regulate the voltage. You can find those types of transistor in the path of the mobile phone charging path. Okay, so you will get this type of voltage regulator transistor in the path of the mobile phone charge path okay the main function of voltage regulator transistor is that 
some time the voltage will be up and down and it help us to make the voltage constant and it gives protection to other components it have three pin available inside it so now you can see there is a three pin available inside it okay guys so now we are discussing about the voltage switch in transistor okay so now you can see it have two pins right so basically voltage switching transistors are also can be found in mobile phone pcb board so you can easily recognize it by watching it from outside it have also two pins so now you can see it have also two pins right and you can see there is few uh, numbers okay so using this number also you can easily find but the numbers may be different but you can easily find out this one okay the main function of voltage switching transistor is that to do voltage switching it can be uh, in many uh, phone but it, in few phones this type of voltage switching transistor may not be found okay so in uh, some phones you will get this type of the voltage switching transistor but in few phones uh, you will not get these types of the voltage switching transistor okay guys so the main function of voltage switching transistor is that to do voltage switching okay so it will uh, work as a voltage switch okay guys so now the main function or oh, sorry uh, now we are uh, going to discuss about the three legs metal oxide semiconductor or mosfet okay so now you can see here this is the images of the three legs uh, metal oxide or uh, semiconductor mosfet so uh, first of all we are going to discuss about the uh, sorry just wait for a moment i forgot so now you can see here this type of three legs mosfet contains three pin with it uh, you can see in the images also those three pins are known as a drain source and gate they uh, have different axes the main function of mosfet is to do voltage switching you can easily find three legs mosfet in your mobile phone pc okay guys so now we can see here uh, especially there is a uh, three pins right so in this side there is a source and gate and in this side you will find the drain okay so in this side you will get the source and gate so in this side you will find drain in this type of three legs metal oxide semiconductor fat or it is known as a mosfet okay so now we are going to discuss about the six legs mosfet so now you can see in the images also so there is a six legs right in this side three legs in this side three legs okay so these types of the mosfet known as the six legs mosfet okay guys so basically so in this uh so six legs mosfet can be found in many chinese mobile phones especially those types of the mosfet contain three pin and it can be in the path of the charging it have six pin and it's uh, its name uh, sorry as its name okay so i did i did a mistake uh, so it contains six pins so i write three pin here but uh, this is mistake okay so i'm just going to cancel this one okay so just wait for a moment yeah so this is not the three pin okay it have six pin so so now you can see in this side there is a six pin okay and in uh, sorry in this side there is a three pin so this type of the mosfet known as a six legs mosfet and it have uh, basically six six legs available okay guys okay so uh, you can also easily find this type of the uh, mosfet okay so just wait for a moment main function of this mosfet is to regulate the voltage in these types of mosfet have four drains and another is source and gate you can easily find these types of six legs mosfet in chinese mobile phone pc keyboard okay guys so especially this type of six legs mosfet uh, uh, can be found in the chinese mobile phone so like in the mi in the oppo vivo so um, those type of phone are using six legs mosfet okay so you can easily find those type of the mosfet okay guys 
So now we are going to discuss about the ethylic metal oxide semiconductor MOSFET. Okay. So now we can see here in this side there is a six uh, sorry eight legs, right? So it have eight things available. So you can easily find out these types of the eight legs MOSFET inside your mobile phone PCB board. Eight legs MOSFET also uh, easily can be found in many mobile phones. It have eight pins, eight its names. These types of MOSFET also can be found in the path of charge. Okay, guys. The main function of 8 leg MOSFET also to keep the voltage for battery regularly. You can easily recognize these types of the bounce strain PCB board. So if you are getting any kind of problem to recognize this type of the 8 legs MOSFET, then let me know in the comment sections. Okay guys. So now we are going to discuss about the pack of transistor. So now we can see in the image also this is the pack of transistor. Okay. So it have also six legs, and now we can tell you you can find few or numbers inside it okay pack of transistor is made by the combination of two transistor you can easily uh, check pack of transistor and PCB board by using multimeter and it contains six legs in it okay so now we can see in the images also it have three legs so uh, you can check uh, easily this type of the transistor using the multimeter and if you don't know how to use the multimeter you can see that those types of the transistors are more powerful than other types of transistor because it have two transistors inside. Okay, so it means the pack of transistors are made by combination of the two transistors. So that's why right. it's more powerful than other types of the transistor. So today we discuss about the many types of the transistor. Okay, and uh, if you are still any kind of confusion, let me know in the comment sections. So uh, basically today we discuss about the uh, bipolar transistor, voltage value transistor, voltage switching transistor. We discuss about the three legs MOSFET, six legs MOSFET, and eight legs MOSFET, and we discuss about the fat transistor also. Okay. So uh, um, I'll come back with another new video. Okay. If you get some knowledge from this video, uh, you can share this video to among the people who are trying to learn the mobile phone train from their home and I'll come back with another new video until that goodbye see you again